Hey everyone, in today's video we are going to learn how to run C slash C++ programs in VS Code. So first of all, we need to install the VS Code application. If it's already installed on your system, then well and good. And if not, then you can check out my previous video about installing VS Code. Next, we need the MinGW GCC G++ compiler for Windows. For that, open your browser. Type in MinGW SourceForge, click enter or you can visit the link given in the description. Click on the first link. Click on download to start downloading the MinGW manual list GNU for Windows. After the download is complete, click on the setup, open it, click on install, continue. And it will start downloading and setting up the MinGW installation manager. So after the installation is complete, click on continue and this will open the MinGW installation manager. Now in the basic setup tab, check this box against MinGW32 GCC++ G++ compiler as we will be needing only this compiler to run our C and C++ files. Check this box, click on mark for installation. Now click on installation, click on apply changes, now click on apply. This might take some time. So after all the changes are applied successfully, we will close this tab. Now we will go to the folder where it is installed. So go to this PC, go to Windows C and here you can see the MinGW folder. Open this folder, open the bin folder. And if you notice here, we can see the G++ and GCC applications here. So this means we can now run our C and C++ programs using these two compilers. Now for using these two compilers, we will need to update the path. So for this, click here and just copy this path. Now in the search bar, type ENV and click on edit the system environment variables. Click on environment variables and here under the user variables for PC tab, select path and click on edit. Click on new and paste the previously copied path here. Click on ok. So now we can use these compilers for compiling our C and C++ programs. Now open Visual Studio Code. In the next step we are going to add two extensions to our Visual Studio Code application. Click on this icon and here search C slash C++. Click enter. Click on the very first extension and install it. Please keep in mind that this extension is from Microsoft. So you have to install this extension only. Next, type in code runner, click enter and click on the very first extension. Install this extension also. Now, if I make a new file, let it be a CPP file, type in our code. And save it as memo.cpp. And now run the code. Then you can see that our program is successfully compiled and we are not getting any errors. Also if I now make a new file which will be a C file, let's save it as demo.c and we will write the hello world program in C language and let's clear the output first. Now if I run this C program then we can see that it worked successfully. So these were all the steps that you had to follow in order to run C slash C++ programs on your Visual Studio code. I hope you liked the video. So thanks for watching this video guys. Don't forget to like, comment and share this video. And if you have not subscribed yet, then subscribe to my channel now to never miss out on any videos like this.